He says, and to make it your ambition to lead a quiet life, you should mind your own business. Everybody, take this is wisdom. Oh, wisdom is coming to you. Mind your own business. Those of you who like talking people's matter, mind your own business. You have nothing to swear, say apart from what you have to say about people. You are not deep. You don't read. You don't have nothing in the head. Hey. Preaching, no. Aye, but if it will worse, you change. Because the change is what is going to give you a blessing in this life. You are going to be blessed in this life. Mind your own business. Stop talking about people. Next time your girlfriend calls you girlfriend to girlfriend. Well, you, well, your, your friend girl is your girlfriend. Your girlfriend calls you or your, your friend girl calls you. Hey. What is saying? Hey, yo. Now swear. Ah, not bad. Now I'm saying, mommy. say. Mind your own business. You don't have a job. You don't have a husband. You can't cook. You can't learn. You don't pass exams. You don't know how to wash your things. You don't know how to arrange things in your room. Now, oh, can't be awesome. You are minding somebody's business when your own business has not been fully minded. Have you tidied your room? Have you bathed? Did you bath before sleeping? So why are, you, why, are you, why are you stretching your big mouth into somebody's business when your own business has not been taken care of? Hmm? Hey, do you know that this guy and his beloved, her beloved, no, they are about to break up. Ah, your own, your own, your relationship that you are in. No? Do you respect the guy? Have you not cried that he is not happy with you? Why are you stretching yourself to talk about somebody's divorcing or breaking up matter when your own is about to also break? Mind your own business. See how to respect your beloved, how to love her well, how to treat her well before you talk about people who are about to break up. Remove the log that is in your eyes so that you can see clearly. Then, log is showing you see a timber is in your face. How can you see the way when you are going? A timber is in your eyes. This type of girls who don't have any proper educational uh, encouragement and motivation, no aspiration in education and reading of any material. Don't read, won't read. Don't cook, won't cook. No, no one say who who people who are dressed. That then you look for the outward appearance and dress. Nothing in the head. Bishop, are you insulting me? Oh. Call your name so that I can say it well, so that the insult can be more direct.